Hi guys, welcome to Thrasone.com. This is Mohit Sony, and right in front of you is the RTR 160, and that is the brand new Hero Extreme 200R. So you're wondering why have we bought these bikes together? That's a 160, and that's a 200, because Hero has cleverly managed to uh, put up a fight with the new 160cc class of motorcycles, with the old school uh, way where it offers more capacity, uh, slightly more power and torque, but at a very competitive price. Um, meanwhile, the RTR 160 is the king of the segment right now. Uh, it's, it's the one West 150 160cc bike out there. So, we'll tell you why uh, these bikes have come together. Is because the performance is quite close to each other. Uh, the pricing is quite close, and as you can see, the Hero is the bigger bike here. Uh, it gets something that the RTR doesn't and RTR has something that the extreme still doesn't. Uh, so is the price comparison or uh, is the price compromise right? We'll, we'll tell you how and let's begin with the styling. The RTR 160 looks shorter, sharper, a uh, much more modern motorcycle and uh, you can look at the design cues that have been borrowed from the RTR 200 which is always great because it was a great looking motorcycle and this one is too. Um, while the Extreme 200R uh, looks great, the tank is good, the graphics are great, the tail lamp, uh, tail piece is good, uh, but the exhaust is quite old school. You do get uh, 17 inch wheels, which is great. Uh, you get this tank pad. Uh, the RTR gets a lot of information. To check that, go to our uh, RTR 160 video where we explain you a lot of features that it has but uh, the extreme here only makes do with uh, the analog digital uh, cluster that has time service reminder and a side stand warning uh, lamp that is it you do get a both bikes get an engine kill switch and EHO so let's begin with the performance uh, first uh, because both these bikes in our testing um, deliver very similar timings uh, both these bikes do 0 to 16 around four and a half seconds and 0 to 100 in 14 and a half seconds it's so the numbers are so close to each other that um, you know you uh, can't uh, deny the fact that the RTR 160 is a so much more accomplished bike despite low capacity and uh, slightly lower power it makes 16.5 bhp that makes 18 bhp and 17 newton meters while this makes 14.8 newton meters um obviously uh, the uh, RTR is lighter but the extreme makes uh, uh, makes up for that in the ride and handling department uh, because both these bikes handle really well uh, these Indian made bikes uh, these Indian bikes here uh, display a lot of confidence in the chassis the suspension is done right they almost feel European to ride uh, obviously uh, the RTR here feels more sporty uh, because the chassis tuning is far more racier while the uh, feel from the chassis of the uh, Extreme 200R here uh, feels a little commuterish it feels more stable and more uh, confident and mature while this does that while feeling very sporty so the RTR 160 uh, is the sportiest bike of the lot to look at in the way the engine sounds in the way the chassis behaves it's a much more playful bike that is what also we noticed when we compared the FZ25 with the RTR 200 um, the Yamaha felt more uh, commuterish while the RTR uh, felt very more sporty uh, TVS has done a really great job with this platform here uh, with the new monoshock system the new uh, front forks and the entire tuning is just just perfect uh, it's a more playful motorcycle much more sporty motorcycle and uh, the hero isn't far behind it has a smaller wheelbase than the TVS Apache so it is quite nimble quite agile and it turns in quite well the tires are really great the brakes are really good on both these bikes uh, the TVS Remora tires don't get them wrong anymore. They've improved by a huge margin. They do not feel inferior at all now. They are on par with those MRFs right there. Um, and uh, yeah, the brakes, the tires are really impressive. The Extreme also has something to offer here. Uh, while both have similar performances, uh, it's a very uh, difficult question uh, when you ask somebody which bike you should choose well uh, uh, i if i were to choose 
um i would have the rtr 160 because it's much more playful but you cannot deny the fact that the extreme is a much more um overall as an overall package um for everybody let's say in the family everybody would appreciate that bike for a better low and talk a better mid range a, a punchier mid range um and it's a subtle nature of being a uh, conventional rather than outright sporty that the rtr 160 is um also the fact for now or let's say couple of months uh, the extreme has an advantage where it gets abs which is single channel uh, while the tvs is expected to get the same and it will uh, get a dual channel abs very likely uh, we can't say anything right now whether it will get a single or double but uh, uh, let's wait for that uh, in terms of pricing um the extreme is a bit expensive it is not entirely value for money because you don't get much features with it but you do get what the main highlight here is the fact that it gets a bigger engine it gets a nice ride and handling package and uh, it is a competent motorcycle um but the winner of the test and by a subtle margin is the rtr 160 because it comes across as a great bike it's it's also easy to drive anybody can drive it and it's very sporty at the same time that balance needs to be rewarded rather well and uh, yeah it being cheaper more few uh, economical and offering a much more sportier package along with being uh, conventional and easy to ride it makes for a slightly better uh, bike and enhance it wins this test but uh, cannot deny the fact that hero has the old school advantage of more capacity slightly more power and talk uh, which you can use um it still is a very tough question for me personally but uh, we have a winner for this test so thank you so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you have any comments please leave it leave them in the comment section below share this video if one of your friends is confused between buying these two bikes and uh, social follow us on social media uh, links in the description below Thank you so much for watching and goodbye